today we're testing out this uh 360 or the insta 360 one x2 just got this for christmas thanks to my wonderful fiance i don't know if you guys can be able to hear me with the wind so this is a good wind test for this camera we're gonna test this thing out today it's uh kind of heavy i got my gopro in the pocket just in case but uh mount rose cruising day no park no problem it's mellow
I reviewed some of the footage and the audio on the Insta360 is awful. So I was filming inside my truck, but every single time that the stick hit something, you'd hear it echo and it sounded like I was talking inside of a fishbowl. Yeah. Next video from here, probably gonna be out in the camera, but uh, yeah, so. Um, so uh, I'm gonna end it here in the garage. Um, let me guys know what you guys thought about the 360 footage. It took a little bit. The Insta360 software is actually super good for computer. It's a little slow on the phone, but I did do some editing in the lodge real quick with just like on the phone doing a really quick edit. And it's super sick to edit that way because you can get footage out really quickly. The scrubbing through is a little bit weird because it's so small on the phone, but pretty decent. So let me know what you guys thought about the 360 footage. Uh, if you guys liked it, any comments, any suggestions, let me know. It was the first day out riding with it. I don't really like riding with stuff in my hands, but that thing was really nice because I just had to have it wherever it was. Obviously probably should have had it a little bit higher than I did, but we'll get around to using it a little bit more and get more and more used to it. So uh, yeah, leave a comment down below what you guys thought. Uh, hit the subscribe if you guys wanna see more and have a good one guys. Peace.